Hey guys, it's Benny. I'm a homo, and today's your Wednesday. Just came to say hello. So here I am at the beautiful Easton Town Center here in Columbus, Ohio. I'm just sitting outside on my break. I have just um, thought I'd share a few moments with you, and I just wanted to let you know, today's vlog is entirely devoted to what friendship means to me. My friends are my most important people in my life. I hang out with them every day. Currently, they're more important to me than, like, finding a relationship because your friends will always be there for you, but sometimes guys won't. But, like I said, today is all devoted to friendship. Just a few things about what I think it means to be a friend. It means to be there for everything, you know, whether you're going through surgery or you're having a bad day or really just about anything, you know. Just somebody to talk to, share your feelings with, you know, when you don't necessarily have somebody else. And then just to spend your free time. Nobody wants to spend all day, every day, doing nothing alone. I've met some great friends recently, the Don't Say Hate crew. I didn't really know any of them, like I said, except for Ty until recently. We all get along great. I mean, obviously we have our disagreements sometimes. Zach and I like to fight a little bit about silliness. He's, he's a little bit pushy. In the end, we all get along great. We are all going to Chicago together. We're super, super, super excited about that. But on the flip side of all that, spending all your time with your friends, you also have those friends you know, maybe some friends from high school or from college that, you know, you don't necessarily see every day. But um, maybe you only see them once or twice a year and they're still your best friends just because you guys have been through so much together. Um, one of those friends is Courtney, who I'm going to see in Chicago. I'm really, really excited about it. Um, but then also, you know, it's just it's just a unique experience, you know. You, when you see them and you haven't seen them in a long time, it's like things have never changed and, you know, it brings back a lot of memories. It's a good feeling to have those friends, you know, they're going to be in your life forever. Oh, look at that advertisement for Chase. No, um, but that's really um, exciting to have that sort of relationship and connection with someone where you can um, just not see them for a year and then pick up right where things left off and you all fall back into old habits. Sometimes, you know, sometimes you've changed and you know you want to catch up, but ultimately your friends are your friends because you like to spend time with them and you're happy when you're around them. So you really don't want to change how you experience that because that's why they're your friend to begin with because you have a fun hanging out with them. Now, I don't know about you guys. Me personally, with some of my friends, I sometimes treat them um, a little bit more meanly than I would treat um, like a stranger just because, you know, I know if I take my frustrations out on my friends, they will still be there. Whereas if I take my frustrations out on a stranger, they might pop, you know, might punch me in the face. But ultimately, your friends, you shouldn't do that to them. I know I do that, um, and I know a lot of people do that. They are kind of mean to their friends. You need to be nice to your friends all the time. That's why they're there. If you're mean to them too much, take your frustrations out on them too much, they will leave you, and you don't want that to happen. They're your friends. And just as um, with, like, rules of intimacy, there's also, like, rules of friendship. I don't necessarily believe in all the rules of friendship, you know, the mean girls thing, you can't sit with us, you know, no sweatpants, stuff like that. Now I go by that, no sweatpants, that means you, Jimmy, no sweatpants, especially in public. Yeah, there really are no set rules, but it's like unspoken. They shouldn't be silly, but there are just a few things friends shouldn't do, such as friends shouldn't let friends wear white after Labor Day. Friends also shouldn't let friends drive drunk or without seatbelts. It's just stupid. The seatbelt thing, I don't really care about, but... I know they save lives. Friends should never let friends drive intoxicated. That's like a big thing to me. Um, no one should ever drive intoxicated. If your friends let you do that, then that's an issue that you need to talk about with them. Friends shouldn't let friends take advantage of people when they're intoxicated. So if you have friends out there that 
get people drunk just so they can sleep with him. That's a no-no, that's rape, so it needs to stop. I'm just gonna wrap up this little video about friendship. I'm now sitting at um, North Star Cafe here at Easton. Just one more thing about friendship. Friendship, you can meet friends anywhere. I've met some of my best friends online and I've since met them. Um, really all it means to be a friend is to care about somebody. You care about their well-being. So there are some people I've, I've never met that I care about. Um, but ultimately, it's just who, who you care about. That's your friends. But um, I've met some of my best friends as um, like potential dates. So like people that I went on a date with and then we turned out to be best friends. So that's really all I have for you this week. We only have eight days till market day that will be in Chicago for market days. Um, it's going to be super fun, so I hope you can come out and see us and support us. Um, remember, if you like our vlogs, please check us out on Facebook. And then go to the website, don'tsayhate.com. If you have any ideas for vlogs or blogs or whatever you want to call this, um, shoot me an email. It's benny at don'tsayhate.com. And it's H8 instead of H-A-T-E. Um, have a great night. I'm about to eat um, my favorite food, which is old pork. And somebody just walked by with the same exact sandwich I'm about to have. And it looks amazing.